Alright, Horus here with another episode of the Roman Empire. Last time we defended against the Gallic Confederation attempting to take our Killam, we created a new legion which we're still building up. Which ought to be pretty good. Concordialis will eventually team up with Verdigala and the two of them, uh, Verdigala, with the Herculia, and the two of them will start a invasion in earnest while we finish up consolidating in Massalia. Four more turns there until we get a garrison, and I feel confident enough to move out. Most likely, I will, by that point, be able to simply march north to Bibracte. Bibracte. Usually I can pronounce that. I don't know why I can't now. And, uh, <clears throat> we don't need to worry about Visantio. I think that that's going to be a good enough buffer against Trevorum from any kind of counterattack coming from there. We're gonna hope that Athens doesn't decide to declare war on me yet, though it's looking more and more likely they will simply because they keep fighting my client state. And over here we will once again move north our Samosata and Trapezos, while at the same time moving these legions to Antioch and then one to Edessa. <clears throat> So it's like the most likely scenario for me to make some sort of headway here. I will have to wait two more turns before I can do that at Tarsus. I simply feel like that would be the better option. Uh, though, actually, there doesn't seem to be any kind of enemies anywhere nearby that might invade me. So it might be doable to simply move out, maybe park one of the legions halfway in between so that during the turn where I'm building up, because I'm planning on fighting that battle out, I'll have uh, a uh, reinforcement range to Tarsus, but I don't know. If there's no units in that city, it may not matter. Yeah, I don't think it matters. But we're going to do it anyway, just in case. Uh, I'm just going to move a navy south to assist here. What do we got? We got uh, Salamis, which is going to bounce to Tyros. Yeah. In which case, I will simply move this over to Antioch. I'll move that one down. So it's going to be a while before we can get the Navy to assist over at Alexandria. Hopefully they can hold till then. If they can't, I'll simply take the city. So anyway, that's the... Uh, Nature well sure of the world at the moment, so we'll begin. So hopefully the uh while the spirits of our hands Every time I begin talking. Okay, so hopefully the group that's working on the siting of this apartment complex do not come on this side of the place until I'm done recording, but they are scheduled to re side the entire side of our apartment, which will be a lot of hammering and a lot of noise. So if they do, though, this will unfortunately be a shorter piece just because... I don't need that in the background, it's hard enough to concentrate sometimes. I set aside what? my sword to speak to you, warrior to warrior. This what? is the way of the world for men. Holy cow. Are you serious? Are you serious? change things up a little bit. We can concentrate again on our eastern war again. That was weird. 
I think that was not very likely, so that's I don't know what to make that. Huh. like crazy in this place. <clears throat> okay. Well, let's uh, demobilize our army over here then, shall we? Stop attacking my ally, dang it. Aggravating. Whatever. But you guys Do not attempt trade. to sweeten truth with honey. I'm not giving you anything for it either. But supposedly you count towards my victory goals, apparently. <clears throat> Which appear to be met. With the exception of needing Armenia and Britannia. Holy cow. I am not sure. Economic victory, I don't remember that one. I've been playing too much Attila, I guess. Yeah, so, uh, we may be near the end of this one. That's weird. Uh, we definitely don't have a complete empire, so to speak, not contiguous like you would think. But I will say, uh, we got a pretty good stand here, and uh, would be kind of nice to progress to a different campaign, possibly, uh, like I said, moving on to the Age of Octavian and do an Imperator Augustus campaign, which, those are fun. I know we didn't get to see some of the stuff. I will upgrade and fight a battle so we can see the professional soldiery. Just so we can debut that from the mods. And, uh... <coughs> depending on what happens in Britannia, I may be invading that shortly. Although, I have a feeling... Uh, like, this doesn't bother me if the Bowie declare war on me again and uh, come against me. I got a pretty short up border here and I don't have any problems with that. Greece bothers me too no end. I really want that. Um, but that'll irritate Macedonia. Gaul is going to be a problem because I really want that land and I want to fight the battles there, but it may wait for a little bit just because uh, I want to finish this up in the east first, build that border up, hold it, and then I can concentrate on doing that. I may double cross them, I don't know. Find out. Not too worried about it if I do. 
for orders. Stay as you are. On 
have pledged a glorious victory here today. I like their confidence in you men. I like it. Such confidence will, I am sure, be entirely justified by what you achieve today. Onwards! Yeah! Yeah, he's cool. I really like that outfit. I want that. It's an awesome looking curious. Worry about them. Nothing else. Pretty neat looking, I'll admit. Painted well, guys. Good job, Modern. Take that man's thing. His armor is First go, or hiding behind everybody else. I don't know if I like that. You guys coming down here? I think so. Yeah, so we'll just kind of hang out here then. Well, we fine. <coughs> Fighting Kobo and the Seleucid Empire. is turning in our favor. Has used all its ammunition. Oh, man, here goes the enemy general. Three of spears, pretty well heavily armored, but that's about it.
One of our units has used all its ammunition. Legionaries! Okay, peel off, Legionaries. Do your thing. Equitates! Swift melee cavalry! Riders! At the double! Romans, ready for duty! <coughs> An entire unit has perished! Yeah, I'm bigger. Thank you. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Eh. It'll be fun. However, not like you doing that. Understood. Great formation and charge, please. Surprisingly, they're holding. Yep, not for much longer, though. Equites! Equites! Advance! Melee Holzman! Alright. That'll work. Just because I lost those two units of camp that not had, then I probably would have been alright. But, eh. Honestly, there was really no way to pull out without losing those units anyway. So I just had to leave them stuck in. <laughs> lost a unit back, but is that ain't bad. We will occupy. We hunger. in Armenia, apparently. I know. My sword is yours. Let's move this direction and see what we got in our here. Nothing. Wow. Okay. Well, do what you do. She's doing that. We're gonna wait one more turn, so it'll be summer. Not bad, not bad. Go ahead and do that. Why not? <clears throat> Cannot believe they're now my clan state, like the Bowie. Whatever it is about these guys, they don't like war. <laughs> After they lose a few battles, they decide they just want to be my puppet state, which, that's nice, but not really all that useful for me. Tyros! Wow, they got Scythian hoplites. Weird thought in itself. Pikemen, some tribesmen, slingers, that should be okay. Uh, do I dare it? A duly attacked tire. An amphibious landing. Those hoplites are rough. They're probably gonna put up a fight. Those ships are going to land, their armor pierces. This is Analis. We're going to just auto resolve it. I just don't feel like I'm going to do as good. And on 
honestly, I'm gonna need that fleet to re... Yeah, that's not too bad. It'll have to, uh... Replenish, and then we'll go and attack. It'll take two turns for that, that's not bad. We got shipwrights, which would be a good idea here. That'll get us some, uh... Apparently Eastern units. Uh, cohort barracks. Almira would probably be better to have here for that. We're staying true to the locations we're at. These are not famous farmlands, but really good herding grounds. Um, for the time being, we're going to do that. We're probably going to dis dismantle it or whatever here in a little bit, but for the time being. Uh, so Antioch is under attack. Here's... yeah. Um, duh, it's under attack. What am I saying? Uh, it appears to be doing well under siege is what I'm saying. Uh, Basilia, two more turns. We do have some ships here, a couple of levees. Yeah, we're gonna build that up a little more. I haven't paid attention to Alalia for a while. Looks pretty good though, so I think we're alright there. Rome needs good fighters. No, actually, I'm gonna do Scutari. Scutari sounds pretty good, and that's a good unit to have anyway. One looks alright, although I'm looking at it. I'm looking at how much food I have. I'm gonna go ahead and upgrade that barracks there. What kind of barracks we got over here? Hmm? Yeah. Just that guy. It's a pretty strong little settlement, if I say so myself. Pretty neat looking. Compact but powerful. I would say that is not a great idea. Where are we at sea? Ships to port. Well, that was odd. But anyway, I'm Tudor on. Oh, let's get rid of that. Unfortunately, compared to the assault on uh, Tarsus, Antioch's probably going to be a fizzle of a fight, but we're still going to do it. Uh, what are you doing moving your forces out? Defend your capital, baby. It looks like i got to run all the way down there.
right. Hmm. Don't know if I can actually land here. That's a problem. It's a big problem, actually. This is definitely Egyptian looking city here, complete with a small Egyptian temple here. Weird Ptolemaic design. And a bustling, well to do middle class district here, merchants and the like. Looks like I don't have too many shanty towns in this city. Some of the bigger villas over here for the rich and famous on the outskirts. Man, that's a bad place to set up your house in this place because it's about to get wrecked. But anyway, um, yeah, and looks like, yeah, over here is where the poor uh, classes live. It's not saying much because there's still some pretty good sized ones like the old villa here and these warehouses. Wow. They actually got some sort of method to the madness in this city when they designed it. Not bad. Good job, artists. Okay, so anyway. Uh, I am probably going to move these guys all around, so this may not be the easiest battle, to say the least. Try it. General. The eyes of the Senate and all Rome are upon us today. We must make them proud that we are their defenders. More than that, our Roman gods are watching. didn't go, so we'll just leave him here for now. I'll probably end up landing him over here to join up in a minute. <laughs> ah, waste your shots, I don't care. side we do actually get to see Tarsus, so that's nice. An entire unit has perished.
casualties, but I don't think I ought to do more than I am. An entire unit has perished. I'm sure so. One of our units has used all its ammunition. The wavering. Not mine. Oh, yeah, they are mine. Oh well. Melee troops. That's fine. Why are you getting the dang? Uh, Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Oh, my 
field of battle. This is a shameful display. One of our units has used all its ammunition. They just keep throwing these guys at me, one after another. They aren't trying to keep me from pushing out. It's weird. One of our units has used all its ammunition. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. Tire, so 
will have to uh, continue this another day. So, looks pretty bleak for this Navy, but we'll be back. And next episode, we ought to have a Siege of Tyre. Or Siege of well, we will definitely have a uh, Conquest of Tyre, but we'll also have our Assault on Antioch. And we'll see what else there happens to be. So, I will leave it here until next time. So, I will see you later.